This training intervention is brought to you by the Sunlum Foundation. In the third part to this series, we are going to be looking at gambling, speculation and insurance. So far, we have visited saving and investment. Now we have to look at the higher risks associated with speculation and gambling. Right, let's start off with gambling. Is gambling a way to create a financial future? Well, let's demonstrate it easily with reference to the National Lottery. What are your chances of winning a lotto jackpot? If you work it out, it's 1 in 13 million. So if you bought a lotto ticket for 13 million weeks, you might win a jackpot. You're just not going to live for that long. Why? What we are saying is that we have an insane risk and the only way to manage that would be in an insane investment period. That is why we say gambling is just for fun and that's where the old adage comes from, responsible gamblers know when to stop. Gambling is not a part of financial planning. So let's move down to speculation. What's that all about? Well, speculation you could dismiss as being a form of gambling. But we also have to consider in South Africa the chances of being involved in a car crash, theft, violence and crime, death and disability. And all the odds associated with this are very long. But they are real in South Africa today. And that's why we have to look at insurance. Insurance is a form of speculation where you pay a premium speculating that there is the odd chance that one of those unfortunate things could happen to you. So one can associate speculation with insurance. And insurance policies are very important in the concept of financial planning because we have to keep ourselves covered until our investments grow to a position that we can self-insure ourselves. The problem is, what insurance do you need? There are millions of products out there and you've got to get the right product at the right price. And very importantly in this regard, you are a graduate and that entitles you to a very favorable premium rate. Right, here we have the Sunlum Life Calculators and what you can see from this is simple calculations demonstrating the difference between saving, investment, speculation and gambling. So let's start off with a saving plan. You've got nothing to start off with. Then you invest 150 Rand per month and we escalate that saving by 7% per annum. We save for 25 years and we are getting an after-tax return on savings currently in the region of 4%. This would give you a future value in 25 years time of 169,264 Rand. But if inflation is running at 7% at the same time, the maturity value is actually 31,187 Rands in today's terms. That's a very disappointing performance. But over a 25-year period, you can take on some risk. So with a correctly structured investment plan, we can then take the investment return rate up to 12%. This immediately increases the future value of the investment to 443,226 Rand and the ultimate value in today's term 81664 nearly three times as much as you would have achieved through a savings plan when we look at that what we've got to say is taking on a 12 percent investment return is reasonable in today's terms as over many years the stock markets have averaged about 15 percent there are those that look for higher returns and this is where they start taking on more risk and they start looking for an investment return of around 20%. And this is where the numbers get quite staggering. In this case, the maturity value would be 1,3 million rand. But, and in today's terms, that would be 253,000 for saving 150 rand for 25 years. But what one's got to realize is that when one starts speculating and expecting a return of 20%, there is always the risk that the speculation could go fundamentally wrong and that you could lose everything. Of course, then we also see advertisements claiming returns of up to 50% per annum have been achieved. That's gambling. And it can give these sort of staggering numbers that one sees over a 25-year period. 
but those are not numbers. They don't take into account the fact that you could very easily lose the whole lot in the course of 25 years. So what do we have? In understanding risk, we say saving is for creating a war chest. That's to see you through your monthly expenses. Invent investment is where one looks to get some wealth creation over the long term by combining a higher return using equity-based investment. Speculating is left to insurance companies to cover your day-to-day -day risks that are beyond your saving and investment plans. And gambling is kept just for fun. This training intervention was brought to you by the Sunland Foundation.